Hey, this is Joe Burnage with Big West Marketing. In this video, we're gonna talk about digital marketing tools you can use to scale your marketing agency. Let's jump right in. Okay, so this is the third video in a series. The first one was how to build and how to start and scale a digital marketing agency from zero to $700,000 without you know, going through all the headaches that I went through. Second video was my YouTube client machine, how to get clients using YouTube, free YouTube videos, okay? So check those two videos out if you haven't already, but this one's all about the specific tools that I use in my agency because I've been through hundreds of tools and I've found the ones that work the best. So here are the four sections of this video we're gonna talk about. Number one, we're gonna talk about SEO specific tools that I use because I have an SEO agency. So if you don't have an SEO agency, it'll go quick and then I'm gonna get into something that's gonna help everybody which is the, the website stuff, the website design and hosting because if you're not offering web design, whether you do it yourself or not, then you're missing out on a lot of money and a lot of opportunity. Number three, we're gonna talk about tools to scale. The tools that I've used over the years that don't work and then the ones that do work to take you to the moon. And then number four, I have three books that I wanna share with you guys that have really changed my life and made this, this agency what it is today. So let's get started right now. So number one, we're talking about SEO specific tools. The first tool that I love is SE ranking. Now I'm not gonna get into the how-to of what we use it exactly for and, and all that stuff. I'm gonna have other videos, like review videos on how to use it. But I wanna let you guys know that we've been through lots of these like rank tracking tools and this and that. And I, w I wanted to find the one that was easiest for anybody on my team to use and that would also create reports that look really good for the clients. And it turns out SE ranking is the best price, it's the easiest to use and my clients love it. So I highly recommend SE ranking for SEO reports, SEO tracking, and even it does all kinds of extra stuff with like keywords and, and links and all kinds of stuff. It's like an all-in-one package. I haven't found anything like it on the market. Click on the link below. So like I said in the last video, I'm gonna put links down below to everything. And these are my partner links. If you click on these, it really helps me out. If you click on my links, I get a little bit of a cut. It's a good way to say thank you, Joe, for creating all this free content and we can just help each other out, it's a win-win. The second tool that I wanna talk about is called Surfer SEO. If you're in the SEO game, then you definitely wanna have this, even if, you're do even if it's just for your own website. You wanna have this because it's gonna tell you how to create and structure the content on your website. Content is king when it comes to SEO, in addition to backlinks, but still, content, if you don't have your content nailed, you're missing out on thousands and thousands of dollars and, th and thousands of, of uh, traffic hits to your website or your client's website. So if you wanna get the content right, get Surfer SEO. Now there's two more tools that I wanna talk about that have to do with like finding like what competitors are doing for Google Ads and for SEO. Um, and then also like keyword research. You know, keyword research, if you're doing any kind of search marketing, whether it's ads or SEO, keyword research is so damn important for both you and for your clients. So I wanna recommend both Ahrefs, it's Ahrefs, Dot com and then I also want to recommend SEMrush, SEMrush.com. Both of them are amazing. I've got other videos that you want to check out where I do deep dives and reviews and demos so you can see how to really take your business and your client's business to the next level. Check those links out below. And then of course you want to have Google Analytics and Google Analytics is free. You want to put this on your client's websites. You want to put it on your own website. Check out your own traffic stats, where things are coming from. But more importantly, when you when you can show your clients that you're actually making progress on their campaigns, and I don't care if it's Facebook ads or SEO or whatever, Google Analytics is the way to do that. It's free. It's easy to install. It takes a little, little bit of learning curve to read it and understand the ins and outs of it, but it's definitely a good investment of your time to get Google Analytics installed on your website and all of your clients' websites. Now, as far as backlinks are concerned, the best way to do backlinks is to build your own backlink network. Some people call them PBNs. I don't like that word because PBNs can be very spammy, but if you do it right and you do it legit, it can be very helpful for your website and your clients to rank up in Google. Okay, and so um, once, and I'm not gonna get into the details of that because once again, I'm putting a link to a course for how to build out that network, 
but I struggled forever to find the, these two pieces of software that have literally changed my life. So I use, it's called Launch CDN. And if you wanna check that out with the link below, you're gonna see it's, once again, it's, it, I've talked to the, the owner and um, I love the ease of use and just the, the, the user friendliness of this. And then they, it, they have a really good way of hiding all of the, diff, the different IPs and all this kind of stuff you need to do if you have your backlink, backlink network so that you stay safe, say, <laughs> Say stay safe and don't waste a lot of money and you have to you don't have to worry about getting hacked and all of that kind of stuff. So that's a little bit advanced, but it depends on where you are in, in your journey. Um, some of that stuff you may need, some of it you may not need, but I put the links below just in case you want to check all this stuff out. And I also want to mention education. If you are new and you really want to get educated on SEO, I put links to a couple Udemy courses that I really like that will step you through how to do SEO. Now, if you're going to outsource SEO, that's going to be in the next video, but I do want to say that you can always find people to help you on Upwork.com. It's just another tool that I use. Like I said, in the next video, we're going to go deep down dive into outsourcing. So check that one out. So the number one thing you need to have is a nice website that gets people to call you because you're going to send people from YouTube, you know, you're going to give them a call to action to go to my website and book a call, whatever it may be. So I'm going to show you exactly what I use. It's cheap. It's easy to learn. So we're at Google. Let's go to my website, bigwestmarketing.com. Okay, so this is my website, and you can see I got little calls to action. So this little thing that pops up in the bottom, that's called ConvertBox. I'll put a link to ConvertBox below, and this thing has tripled the number of people that book once they hit our website. So like I said, they go from YouTube, YouTube call to action, to website, and then this is the call to action for the website. I also put my big phone number up here, and of course my logo. I'm going to show you some software you can use to create your own logo or where to buy it. Um, and then I make just a, a nice, slick WordPress website. Check out my website, copy stuff, whatever you want, um, and, and use the same formatting and stuff. Now, what is the theme that I use to build a WordPress website like this? Well, there's two things I use. I use Genesis, okay, but that's a little expensive and there is a high learning curve, but lately I've been using this thing called Thrive Themes. Okay, and Thrive Themes will actually allow you to make really slick landing pages. So like for example, I got this power pack for my clients. So get your free marketing power pack. It's got this little opt-in. It does all this opt-in stuff for you, okay? And then it connects over with my active campaign software so I can do email marketing. And that's another step in it is that you take it from YouTube to your website, they book a call, you get their email, Okay, and then you email them once a month or once a week or however long, however much you think is necessary to get your business going. This is how you scale a digital marketing business, okay? This isn't just about getting clients, it's about getting clients in the long term and getting a machine that constantly gives you new clients as you move th forward and as you scale your marketing agency. Like I said, I went from $0 to $700,000 and this is how I did it, guys. I'm giving you my secrets. Okay, and then to make cool graphics, you know, if you don't want to be a graphic designer but you still want to crank out graphics for landing pages or logos or uh, lead magnets, stuff like that, and here's a picture of a lead magnet that I created using this program called Canva. You probably have heard of Canva, Canva, but you may have not used it. It totally replaced me using Photoshop. I used to be a Photoshop guy, but now I replace Photoshop with Canva because it's so damn easy to use, okay? And they have good support and they'll help you out if you get stuck on something. So click on, click on the link below, grab Canva as well. And now once you hit like a thousand subscribers and you really want to get into some like good email autom automation and funnel building and stuff like that, there's all these cheesy softwares out there like ClickFunnels and all this stuff. And it's great for beginners, but once you really get serious, like once I got serious with my agency and now I wanted to really scale up, I turned to Keep. Anyway, this is what's really taking my business to the next level because I can set up really targeted campaigns, visualize everything very easily, make sure the right people are getting the right emails, takes all the complication out of it. There is a learning curve on this one, so do not go get it right away. Wait till you hit, wait till you get to the 100,000 mark and you have about 1,000 people on your email list, then you can really start scaling up with a, with a, a software like Keep. Once again, link down below if you're already at that level. Now, who do I use to host this website? So there's two hosts that I've used in the past. I've used Bluehost in the past, which are really good, so I'll put a link down there. The reason I like them is because they're easy to set up WordPress sites, first of all. Number two, they have great support, okay? And number three, I feel like that they um, are very flexible in allowing you to add plugins and 
uh, themes and, and stuff like that. Just a really good solid company to work for, especially for the beginner. And as you get a little more advanced, or maybe you already are advanced, you may want to look into WP Engine. Okay, WP Engine, more expensive than Bluehost, but they have really good security settings. Once again, service is awesome. They're just made for WordPress specifically. And when you get to a certain level, you really start getting some traffic coming in. I highly recommend you upgrade to them. Or if you are already got a good website and everything, I recommend you transfer over to them. If you want something solid, secure, that's never going to get hacked, that's fast, that has awesome support. And then when I decided that I wanted to also host my clients websites and you know we make it like an extra five thousand dollars a month just on hosting so I highly recommend you do that at some point now we use a solution called turnkey internet and we actually have a server with them and the reason I like them is they're a small company kind of like ours and um, we know everybody's name over there and I've talked to the owner before but we have our server over there they're super helpful I don't have to be a tech guy I can still be a host and have them manage all the tech stuff and the updates and all the, the server stuff they handle it all turnkey internet because like I said I have been through hundreds of tools and software over the years and it took me forever to compile this tight list of softwares that I love so lastly I want to talk about three books that I love that have helped me with all of this kind of stuff and grow number one is traction by Gino Wickman this is all about the EOS the entrepreneur operating system it works for any business but I tell you what I've, I like this book so much I end up hiring an implementer to help us get everything organized systemized because once you start taking on you know once you start growing and scaling and outsourcing and hiring you're gonna you're gonna run into some major hurdles and you're gonna hit glass ceilings as they call it and you're gonna need some program like this to get you through what's called it's called uh, traction by Gino Wickman once again link is below second book that has really been a game changer life changer actually is Perry Marshall this guy just is awesome this guy cares I've been to his conferences I've been part of his his uh, his uh, groups for a while get his newsletter all that kind of stuff but his book 80 20 sales and marketing once again link below will actually make you 10 times more efficient than you are right now hands down if you follow any of the instructions and this thing, I have to read this book like once a year or once every two years because I forget about all the amazing things that he teaches in this book to make my life easier. And the third book is not so much even a business book, but it's called Find Your Why by Simon Sinek. And if you don't want to read the full book, you can always go watch his YouTube video, which I'll put a link to below. Um, I'll put a link to this book as well. If you want to purchase this book, it's all about you know why you act the way you are, and it's based on it's not like a, it's not a, the the why behind what you do, it, it it creeps into every aspect of your life, and if you if you're aware of it, it helps you make better decisions, it helps you have a happier life, a more fun business. Like my business has been way more fun since I got this book, and I understand myself better. Uh, I highly recommend Find Your Why by Simon Sinek. Ask me questions or tell me what you use in the comments below because I want to make more videos like this and if you guys are wondering about certain pieces of software, I can get that software. I'll spend my money, put my time in to do the reviews for you guys, okay? Just let me know and of course, you know, subscribe and like and share and in the next video, I'm going to get into outsourcing, how to outsource your digital marketing so you can do less and less work but still make good money. Once again, I'm Joe Burnich with Big West Marketing and I will see you in the next video.